Lucas, we're here at uh, AMB Stuttgart 2018. A world premiere, the Hecate T45. I understand this has been based on the X40 model that you built up in Chemnitz. Tell us a little bit more. You see, Mark, we presented the X40 model last year on the Emo Show. So it's one year now that it's on the market and it's having a great success. So uh, what we originally intended and then um, uh, pushed ahead is uh, to make a turning machine from it. Because basically we have all aspects which a turning machine needs in this machine, so from geometry wise. We just need to put a better table, a, a faster table, a fast turning table, and a different, a, mo a much stronger spindle. So we put a HSK 100 spindle with a mechanical clamping and thus have a machine which is capable of a really heavy turning. So it's not just a bit of turning, it's a real lace and it's a full machi horizontal machining center with all the advantages a horizontal machining center is having, like uh, excellent chip fall, like uh, a fast changeover of, uh, of the pallets. So when you, when you look at the head, for instance, the reason it's horizontal to a certain extent is because of the chips? Well, basically, horizontal machining centers have the big advantage that you have a better chip fall, you have the water coming out. Except, uh, if you compare it with a vertical machining center, you're always uh, working within the chips. And with a horizontal center, chips will fall down. And with the uh, table, you can, you can rotate the table, and, and uh, if you have water in or so, you can just uh, pour it out. So have you developed this machine based on customers' needs or an idea that this would be a good seller? It's both. We know the parts customers want to make with it. And um, when we came up with the idea and uh, presented it to the customers, they said, OK, if we had this machine, we could do different parts. That's, for example, um, how we came to do the skiving, what we are showing here on the machine. Um, it's uh, so we. we, we originally didn't intend it but then the customer came and said okay can I make this part and we said yes in the end we can and the type of materials that you're cutting or ideally cutting on the T45 are, are what uh, well it's a uh, heavy material heavy cutting like uh, steel it's um, cast iron but we can do also aluminium so it's a machine which, which is very versatile depending depending on the spindle you put in now, I visited uh, Chemnitz, it's a fantastic facility. Now, these type of machines, you're actually building as a base model, so therefore the time of the build is a lot less. Is, is that the same with the T45? It's the same with the T45, it's coming out of the same box. It's just a variant of the, of the of a same machine. And what type of sectors do you think uh, this machine will actually be very well received? Well, we see this machine in the um, uh, um, transport industry, so like heavy vehicles. We have quite some requests, but also other parts which are uh, basically round. So we find something from uh, from uh, oil industry, valves, flanges, valves, flanges, and so on. So it's it's a very versatile machine, and we can integrate even grinding processes to this machine, like to a lot of other Hackard machines, like to the five-axis machines from Hackard. Uh, so um, basically, customer can do nearly anything where he requires a high precision, high durability of the machine, high versatility. And from a UK perspective, some of those sectors are quite uh, strong within the UK. Do you think this will be a good seller in the UK? I'm sure. I think we already sold the first one or two machines in UK. Well, good luck with the, uh, the machine itself. But yet again, a fantastic stand at AMB Stuttgart 2018. Thank you, Mark.